I don't know. Season 10, man. Sometimes this shit catches up to you. We're not that young. What I would like to do, honestly, I have to eat a 14 hour day. I mean, do you want to look at the budget though? Like, the budget's. No, because I don't, we don't like the budget, but it's not going I don't want to feel guilty. I don't want to know that number until I eat this food. And I, I swear to God, I've had one fucking beer in two days. And I, it, I could, it couldn't be any tighter right now. There have been no skis, there's no snow to ski on. But it's like, I feel like we've done everything. I know. Like our meals today were golf course breakfast, yeah. golf course lunch, and Waffle House. All waters, a couple coffees. <laughs> we didn't get we didn't get snacks at the turn. I haven't added up all the budget yet, but I don't think we're in a great spot. So to answer your question, I don't know where we go from here, but we just want to enjoy this food right now. I'd love back that close to the pin from Old South. That ten dollars was. We did talk about we didn't get up where our skis. That was ten dollars. We might as well. But that, I mean, on fire. I almost felt like you had to do it. But well, I, I legitimately think we were like in a spot we like not really been in in this show. There's got to be. There's got to be like we could sleep in the car. I don't want to do that. <laughs> I know. I don't. Uh, we could. There's a course we talked to that guy Chuck. There's a course. <laughs> we could go to that was like 20 bucks. No, but still. But that's like inland. Still, this is, truly I'm not seeing a path right now. All right, hold that thought, I need to use the bathroom. All right. Sorry. I don't know, like, I know you're filming me right now, but I also want to talk to you because I don't, this is, this is a, a new spot for me. Like, I don't know how we're going to get it under $500. And when also, like, I know this is kind of like a whole bit, like he's one of my best friends and he's getting married in two weeks. And I feel like this has been like, today was, was kind of miserable. Like we sat in the clubhouse for, four hours <laughs> we're soaked we're tired we slept in like a serial killer place last like i don't feel like any part of this is a celebration of like him or a bachelor party like honestly part of me just wants to like almost say like fuck it like if we're gonna go two dollars over budget like let's go two hundred dollars <laughs> over budget right I don't think there's a difference, you know? Uh, right. We've never really uh, it's crossed all, it, the Rubicon. It, never really it's, un, it's truly uncharted waters, right? And if, like, this, like, if they want to say it, like, that's fine. But, like, right now I'm just, like, beaten down. And I feel so bad for him. <laughs> he could be doing, like, his, his fiance's at home, like, literally two weeks before a wedding, like, doing, like, wedding stuff. And he's up in, like, outside Charleston at a Waffle House. <laughs> I had paper towels in the bathroom. <laughs> Dude, I got something radical I, that I just want to say. Okay. And I don't, I don't need you to like react right away, but I just want you to hear it. Mm -hmm. if, if we can't get under $500, I don't know materially what's the difference if we go $2 over budget or $200 over budget. And I feel like, hold on, I feel like this has kind of been a, sh a shitty trip. She hadn't gone as planned. <laughs> I mean, we always know it's going to be tight. I don't know, man. So I got an idea. Okay. And I just want you to hear it. What if we go to Myrtle Beach and just say, screw it? <laughs> How far is it to Myrtle Beach? Well, it's gotta be like, what, two hours? 
two and a half. It's gotta be somewhat close to where we are. Like when I think bachelor party, like let's go ahead and get you a day in Myrtle <laughs> Beach. Just like budget doesn't exist. Well, I'm like we're gonna catch hell regardless. So I don't. I get. Like, I mean, yeah. Like guys, we spent five hundred ten dollars. Guys, we spent seven hundred. That's intriguing. <laughs> it's like that. What happened at Old South when you had? A ten, <laughs> like six was just as bad there, right? Like I feel like we we made our best <laughs> effort to make the play. Yeah, I mean they've always said we played the game the right way, <laughs> no. but like so this is like Lance Armstrong shit. Like, but like this is we're just saying 10, and we, we're gonna nuke it. The true hitters they don't want to die in their sleep. <laughs> they want to die riding. Like I wanna, something. I don't know what, but something. I want to go. I want to go over budget with like big foam hats. An outrageous drink. Can we get some of the like airbrush t-shirts? <laughs> airbrush t-shirt. I would love maybe an animal like shirt. Like of our of our faces. Dude, I bet we there. could find an animal shirt in Myrtle Beach. Like that's how I want to go over budget. Uh, There's no debtors prison. We stuff. can't go to jail. Do you want to make this suicide pack with me? Brother, you know I'm in. <laughs> Let's fucking hit the road. Finish your waffle. Let's get out of here. Let's go to Myrtle Beach. We have to play golf tomorrow. Okay, yeah, for right? sure. We'll play golf. I mean, it can't just be totally yeah, 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 yeah. No, rolling black out. Right, let's find a very appropriate golf course. I was gambling in Havana. I took a little risk. Send lawyers, guns, and money. Dead, get me out of this. Bystander. Somehow I got stuck between the rock and the hard place, and I'm down on my luck. Yes, I'm down on my luck. Well, I'm down on my luck. Send lawyers, guns, and money. We're doing really good. We uh, we got a couple of hotel rooms. Got a good night's sleep. Did you get a good night's sleep? I did. Um, got my own room. <laughs> We're trying to make this a special day for Neil, and very excited about where we're gonna play golf. What's the word, big guy? Where are we going? We're getting close. Check this out. You know, I can't take my boy to like the most special golf course in the world. So I'm bringing all the most special golf courses in the world to us today. And I know you've been talking about replicas. You're the replica golfer. We have 18 replica holes of the finest championship courses in all the world. The International World Tour Golf Links. The Open Nine is named for courses hosting the US and British Open. We're gonna play a hole from Pine Valley. We're gonna play number 16 at Augusta. We're gonna play number 17 at Sawgrass. I don't think any of those places have hosted the US Open, but I like the thought. Right, I don't really know how they named it. You know, I've never really played a replica course. I'm excited, that's gonna be, that's gonna be some fun uh, discussions. Look at this place. Neil told me I look like a dad who looks like he's trying to party, and I was like, honestly, that's kind of how I feel like. <laughs> Randy, what do we got for number one here? Uh, we are traveling to Winged Foot. The east or the west? The east course, number 10. 
There's two potential storylines. We're either balling out or we're blacking out. There's no in between. Yes, sir. Woo! God, that's good. The West. The West is the major course. So we're playing the the, the East course at Wing Foot. Which is still cool. Which is still cool. Which is still really cool. Which is nobody will know what that is. Yeah. But it's still cool. It's the members course. They love it for their yeah. club championships. Yeah, yeah. Hopefully they got the wing foot shower pressure. <laughs> oh, look at my boy. Tachi Tachi. Where are we headed next? Uh, Cypress Woo! Point, coast baby. To, coast to coast, baby. Gonna go see, check in with the good doctor, see what's going on. Maybe Marion Hollins is gonna come party. Number 10, I don't know anything about number 10. Yeah, good par. We hopped on the... Uh, this is one of the most iconic holes in golf. The Gulf Stream from uh, Cyprus and now here we are at Troon. That's cool. The postage stamp. Boom. 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 Hey. Big time up and down. Just Augusta National Golf Club, number 11. Beginning of Amen Corner. Ever heard of it? Can't believe the big guy pulled these strings and got me on out here. I kind of had it. I was thinking about it when I went to bed last night after we made the decision to break bad. Uh, I was like, dude, I'm 100% hitting the mega bonus tomorrow. And the round started off well, and then he had aim in the corner. Be the shark. Felt, feel for Greg. 11, one of the most difficult drives in all of golf. So, you think there's any water up on the right? Like right over here? <laughs> there shouldn't be. Oh, chunked it. I mean, I can't believe this. Where, where are we at? I this think, is... I mean, come on, you don't know come where on. we are. Like, check out the bridges. I mean, even the cell tower. I think at Augusta, they have those that look like pine trees, but I mean, that's really good stuff. I got, well, we have 166 to the flag. True wind gusting situation. I'm hitting a little choke down five. Oh, Hang on. Playing. Down. Yeah, it could be. No, plenty of green. Plenty of green, right? You just, you can't hit it in the water on 12. That's right. Oh, oh, sounded God. heavy. So heavy. Fly. It's a lot of club though. Oh! oh. It could be Freddie Couples. Maybe it held up. Back to back doubles. Mikey, I think we're collapsing here, bud. Can we get uh, maybe six cold beers? Yeah. Uh, Only a spot on the property. Yeah, one more private spots in all of golf. We just saw the beverage cart, so we got a sixer. Now we're 13T, Augusta National. Let's see if we can rope one around the corner. Four, please. Mr. Big now driving. Ooh. Does that shape fit this hole? No oh, straight ball. <laughs> That's going to be up in the pines. Two forty two to the flag. Looks like two fifteen to get above the hazard carry. Into the wind, I know. I just don't have that into the wind. We're, we're gonna lay up, we're gonna play it smart. We're gonna think our way around the corner. 2.30 into the fan. We got three wood. Randy, keep an eye on this one. Oh no, quit that. Back bunker, come on. You may have hit the bridge. Hit the bridge? It looked like you might have hit the bridge. Oh, hey! How the fuck does that How happen? How does that happen? Duffed it. Man, it's two in a row. All right, I'm gonna make this one. 
patrons are gonna go fucking nuts. Huh. It's good leave. Got beat up in the corner. God. How did even corner go for you, Neil? Triple double. Just Russ Westbrook it. Let's get out. Let's get out of Augusta. Come on. I'm having a bad time. Well, we got six beers, so let's drink them. How did Augusta National go? Honestly, I kind of felt like from the minute we walked on the property, they didn't like the way we were dressed. <laughs> they didn't. We were not welcome. So it's kind of on eggshells, yeah. and then I just got my own head and made three doubles in a row and. They said, hey, man, why don't you... They, they tapped you on the shoulder. Yeah. So now we're going out to Olympic Club. Yeah. It fit. It fit the mood. It fit the vibe. It fit. It just... When the pieces fit, it's really fun. I felt like the pieces are fitting today. That, that, that lighter's got stopping power. Brady, do you like cigars? No, I don't like them. I fucking hate them. <laughs> no. Neil, we gotta play for something. I feel like we're losing some mojo. Well, what do you got for me? You know I love steaks. In the name of like bachelor party, I say double or worse, let's chug a beer. Okay. Right? I think double or worse, both have to chug a beer. Yeah. Double or worse, it's both have to chug a beer. Okay, I'm All in. Right. All right. I'm just, I'm wrestling a little bit with the last gasp of the kid, you know? I do, I do. Explain to me why, why does the kid have to die? I mean, I mean at some point you age out of that, that that title, I would think, you know, you become Mr. Schuster. Right. Uh, I think there's still, you can still have whiffs of the kid, but you can't really, you can't hold that title. And I probably stretched it as long as I could, you know? Yeah. It's time to, you know, I'm not Peter Pan. It's kind of like you're sending the elevator back down. Got to. For the next kid. Got to. And there's many more behind me. There will be many, many more. You just, the, the kid doesn't mesh with like a, a loving marriage. That's right. Sometimes. That's right. The kid's selfish. Kids aren't married. Kids a partier. Yeah. Exactly. Very simple. <laughs> <laughs> kids just aren't married. Dude, that's such a good up and down. Oh God, that's the mo we needed for the back nine. It's gonna be historic. Jo back nine Johnny, an ode to back nine Johnny. Come on, Let's get your passport. That. That's the theme. Get your passport. Let's head overseas. Come on, I want to take you to home of golf. Wait, get some more beers. How much was it? Uh, total 75. So we'll account for that. For six, 14 cold beers and some Snickers. 14 beers and a couple snacks? I mean, come on. Come on, that's a good deal. Hey, cheers. Cheers. Let's have a great back nine. Yes, great trip. Neil, I'm happy for you. I think, I think we- Happy, happy for you. you. I think we swung this trip. What's your guys' experience with the old course? Played it once, waited in line early morning hours and it's just hot. It's like the best walk. It's so much fun. You ever dream of taking a cart around? <laughs> I thought when I did play, I thought the one thing missing, I wish I had a cart. Yeah. And like 14 beers. So. Did you? <laughs> now, Neil, I want to tell you the fun thing about playing at the old course, like you got this whole fairway. You, okay. you can aim as far left as you want. You can see the Swilkin Bridge down there. Cool. Yeah. So no excuse to miss right. Okay. Oh no, I miss it right. Man, I still have never seen that ball flight. God, that's in like, down where they film Chariots of Fire. Oh God, that ball hits so hard. Drippy! Oh, oh my God, that's a good putt. Only the British fans know how good that putt was. Well, this is number 16 at Pinehurst number two. A hole I have played, and I see what they're trying to do here, 
but they just don't have the, there's no, the elevation change. That's what we're missing. Um, but we'll reserve judgment until we finish the hole. Oh, I'd say they're doing the best they can, though. It's a par five, so we don't know yet. Get down and stay down, right? Ah. Total bone. Oh, God. Doubles in play. Spin. I've seen you make hundreds of those. One time. Oh, God. Good run at it, though. Give it a run. Hey, listen, triple, double, doesn't matter. We're chugging. Uh, new I'll toast to you. Thanks, man. I'm going to put my lid down. You're going to make me cry. You found the one, and that's that's not nothing. Cheers, brother. Cheers. All right, here we are at the famed 17th at Sawgrass. This, that was, Woo! I mean, truly the gold standard right now. Randy's first time 17, it's in the hole. Seriously go in. Seriously go in. Oh, oh. gosh, not Woo! bad. Oh no. Catch a piece, Catch come a on. Piece. Go, 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 go. Woo! A, a double gun would be tough. I think that's dry. Oh, Maybe. shit. Fuck! All right, smooth swing here. What are you gonna do? I'm not the first guy that's gonna make 10 here. Good hands, big. So classy. It's a hell of an up and down there. I think that's a nine. I, I like seeing you make that. That's great juju. <laughs> uh, here's, to, uh, here's to no man needing nothing. No man needs nothing, that's right. I know for a fact, I've known this, Randy does not like to play golf and to drink. <laughs> he likes to play golf and he likes to drink, but he doesn't like to do them together. Do and and it's, he's not good at it. You need help? And so I appreciate you doing something you didn't want to do, brother. You just took the MVP award from Chris. I want to I want to crown you with that MVP award, okay? I turned to Neil we here through five holes on this side and I was like, dude, I'm 15 over through five. <laughs> <laughs> Not good. Not good. He just kind of loses all the feels. Like it doesn't, it's the, the communication's not traveling down the bottom. Oh, but it was a real pleasure today, man. I'll, I'll remember this round for a long, long time. I the English turns, fellas. <laughs> How the fuck is this course on here? We, we made it to Scotland though. We're back. No, this is in New Orleans. <laughs> it's a Jack Nicholas in New Orleans. In 94, John Daly took four turns from the tee, hitting into the water each time. He then reached the green sign bunker in 10 and finished with a 12. But Can happen to the best of them. It happens. I had a great day. And it wasn't about the score, though we hit all 18 cups. We did. It wasn't about the mega bonus which of course I was trying to get. <laughs> of which there was none. It was about hanging out with you and you, and uh, I had a great time. We're at Pine Valley, which of course the Strat Boys have never been to. Why don't you tell us about the 12th at Pine oh Valley here? Oh my gosh, the 12th is, uh, you know, it's a controversial hole, Randy. It's a short four, and this is pre fos They haven't updated this hole for the renovation yet, so it looks great. How beautiful. I mean, honestly, today was a ton of fun for me too. I shot 97, but this is some of the most fun really? I've had on a golf course in you a long, hit every, long time. You hit every cup, and too. I hit every cup. But That's great stuff. Just the laughs and the good time and knowing what you're stepping off into, it just, it means a lot. So, very cool.
Back to the national. 16 at Augusta. I mean, if I'm being honest, I don't really see it. What's the key to skipping it? You gotta shut the club face, I think. Yeah. Ah. Oh, that was kind of cool. I got it over. Yeah, that was kind of cool. Well, that could have been good. What if you miss the water? Yeah. What I think you get booed by the patrons. <laughs> Shout out to Myrtle Beach for being like maybe one of the least self-conscious places I've ever been. I mean that as a compliment of like, yeah, of course the 18-hole the, the replica course is here. And I mean, some of the replicas are not good, but you know what? That's a conversation starter. And when I'm exactly. sculling beers, it's yeah. fun to be like, you know what, That's a, I see this. And the, on the other side, it's like, no, that's not 16 at Augusta. It's not good. Oh my, Lanta. Come on. And yeah. I'll say this, th like, some of the best greens I've played in a couple years, like the on on strap for sure, for sure. Yeah, they were. They we was, didn't have a putt that good. bobbled or wobbled, or I mean, those greens were were true. I hate to say this, but it almost feels like they knew the Canadians would get passive aggressive if they didn't have representation. You know what? Come what may. Right. Like we'll have to pay that credit card bill at some point, but not yeah. today. 10 seasons in, 30 rounds in, sometimes, sometimes, every once in a while, and that's the key. And that's what makes it special. Yeah, is every once in a while you have to say, fuck it. We're, it doesn't matter. We're just, we're gonna, we're gonna hit every cup, but we don't care about counting right. the budget. Life's too much about budgets. I'm sick of budgets. Oh my God. I'd like to make a cheers to you to the NARC, to Tron, my to best man, to Solly, yes. my compadre, and to my soon-to-be wife, Carson. Tough three putt at the end, but you know what? Life's, life's be like that sometimes. That's okay. Hey. You know what mattered today? We had a lot of Hanging fun. out with you, brother. We had a lot of fun. At 248, okay. plus 228, plus 23, plus 319, plus $38 for lunch, plus $77 for beers on the course. <laughs> a deal, I'd say. Plus $35 for t shirts. <laughs> Plus fifty-five dollars for cigars and a lighter. <laughs> Plus one hundred and twenty dollars at the hibachi. It was delicious. Plus twenty-four dollars at the Bowery. Plus eighteen dollars tonight at the Irish Pro. One thousand one hundred and eighty-five dollars. <laughs> Dude. Right, just burning edges, man. <laughs> it's a game of inches. Fuck. What are we gonna tell them? <laughs> the truth. We're gonna tell them the truth. <laughs> no man needs nothing. Okay? No, no man. Sometimes you just gotta let your hair down, brother. You gotta go get it. You gotta go out there and get it, brother. Talk yourself all the way. I don't know what I'm saying. Cheers, guys. Cheers. To, hey, to the kid. Cheers. <laughs>